she is so fluffy. Anyways, I'm just here to say that this is not a citation episode. You're gonna watch drawings. Is it your tail? It's my tail. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Don't be mean. You're so mean. You're mean to me. And bye, I'm going. Hi. Hi guys, welcome to another video. So, why have I been uploading so many shorts after the citations episode? Literally from my from the day after my birthday all the way to I don't know, like, a few days ago, I've been uploading shorts. Now we have a full video now, okay? We have a full video, even though we did have a vlog and a mukbang, but those don't count. They're still vlogs. They're still stuff. They're not the channel stuff, which is animals. Wow! Today we're looking at some animals, which obviously I drew. What? I don't hire artists. Even if, even if I did. Who is the artist? I am the artist. Huh? Not Let an actual, me see. not an actual artist, or the best artist on this planet, but an artist. Mm. Well, talent-wise, not really by wow. fame. This is okay. Well, this is a war real one. Yes. This is a warthog, and that's a real one. This one is a bit old. Okay, actually, I didn't draw it from that angle, but if I did, it would look like something like that. Yes. So, warthogs are a type of are species of wild pig. Obviously, they're a pig. And not a boar, which I get it sometimes. Warthogs are called wild boars. But wild boars don't have tusks. They're just purely pigs that have fur and are black. I've always seen them on the street eating junk. So warthogs live in Africa, in the savannas, and you'll find them in the deserts. There are two subspecies, the desert warthog and the common warthog. This is meant to be a common warthog. So warthogs have tusks. If you don't know what tusks are, tusks are basically teeth that come out from your cheeks. Well for, well, for example, elephants have tusks. They're just teeth, okay? Warthogs are aggressive. Metaphorically, they could do this. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> awesome. They don't actually do this, but they could do it metaphorically. Okay. I mean, sure, there's one. Is an actual case. Whatever. Okay. Back to the next. Uh, not only that, warthogs will not only do that, but will also just don't stare there. Will also stick the horn, not horns, tusks out of holes, and. Yeah, and a lion does not want to just go into a hole that's stinky and has tusks. Because a lion will get skewered. Hmm. So, it's... Well, warthogs are a pretty small item on the lion's menu, but it's hard to get. Yes, I understand. They're so stinky. I don't think they fart. But they can musk, which is kind of farting. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on, we have the lemur. A red rough lemur. Red rough lemurs at the drawing. The drawing. Over the drawing. Um, we know the vine. The vine is there for creative purposes, as it's a long vine. Starts from one wrench over here. Then goes yes. down his swiggly noodle and comes down here. Yes. So red rough lemurs look something like this. 
Actually, this is the exact picture I use, except the colors are a bit too dark. Mm -hmm. Mm, exact, exact. Maybe the colors were from some other individual, because I didn't want to do such a dark. That's one, that one's a bit too yellow. You could look at some of these. Oh, interesting thing. Their bellies, if you look, are black. Mm. That explains the black leg. Yeah. Nice color. Red rough lemurs live in forests and also coastal forests. Mm. Coastal forests, if you didn't know, are forests near, near the beach, beach. Like if you go through a coastal forest, you'll eventually reach the beach. Red rough lemurs eat fruits, leaves, and all that stuff. Now, you might be thinking, wait a second. Are, can we even call these primates? Look at that face. Isn't that dog face? That's a dog face, isn't that? Oh, little bit. How aren't they primates? Slash monkeys, huh? How? Oh. Well, they're not monkeys, but lemurs are species of wet nosed primates. Wet nosed primates have noses like that. Now, other primates, such as monkeys, have, well, are dry-nosed primates. You see, at one point, all primates were wet-nosed primates. However, some of them evolved to have dry noses and became dry-nosed primates. But lemurs never evolved to the dry-nosed lifestyle. So they're a bit of the primitive one, even though that quite doesn't mean they're living fossils, you know? Moving on, I hope that's enough information. Now, for the final animal, the moose. Wow. Confirmation is the final animal. Look to the other side. What's that? This is known as the void. Even though it's white, it's the void. Let me show. This is a moose, an eastern moose. Oh. I can't find the exact picture. Well, you guys keep looking at that. I can show you some pictures of some moose. Here's a dark variant. And a similar. Hmm. Mo moose are species of, well, you could say deer, but that would be wrong. This species are of stock. You know, they have antlers. Antlers are different from horns. You know why? Antlers fall off. It's not that you're gonna break them off, you can't break them, but they do just fall off. In winter, antlers fall off. In spring, they grow back. That's the diff That's so, uh, the only difference between an antler and a horn. A horn never falls off, <laughs> but you can break off a horn and doubt it will ever grow back. So moose are moose live in North America, but but they do live in Asia, as well this because of this. This is uh this is an Eurasian elk. Wait a second, isn't this supposed to be an elk? Hmm. Why is this moose being called an elk? Why? For some reason in Eurasia, um, the Eurasian moose is called the Eurasian elk. Oh. They're black compared to a North American moose species, such as the eastern moose, which means eastern North America. 
they're brown. So now let's get into. Okay, maybe that name. And yeah, now it's focusing. So let's get into some stuff they like to eat. Mm -hmm. Oh, almost species. Well, obviously eat plants. Why not? So they'll eat. Well, moose will not only eat leaves. They'll also eat the twigs. They're happy to eat the twigs. They're a twig eater. But they'll also jump in the water. Well, here's evidence. What? Oh, this is a this is a female. Mm -hmm. See, no antlers. Mm -hmm. They jump into the water to eat plants, stuff like that. Hmm. Or that. Yeah. But they'll also use the water mm -hmm. to escape from wolves. Because wolves can't swim. Moose can swim, even though it's just a weak battle with the who hoofs. It's not a good one. It's just weak swimming. Anyways, guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, throw that with a bell button in a trash can, break it, and you'll know whenever I upload a video. And I'm pretty sure it's a bit too long. Anyways, I'll see you later. Bye!